I'm doing this in an awkward position. <laughs> but I'm getting a good shot. <laughs> but my question is, why is my phone so dark? The light is on. But yet, this is the only room that is dark in. I think the energy in the f is wrong with you? What, what is wrong with you? Bro, something back here, like, growled and then stomped really hard. That was after I grabbed him initially. Hey, cool, you still wanna, uh, be that, uh... Or are you good? You ready? Yeah. So the first time using a gibble, test it out, see what we can do. We're just walking around, starting from the bottom, we're going way up to the top. Pop outs tonight. Pop outs, huh? Yeah. Okay. Popping out and then running and hiding. Mm -hmm. We've experienced that before though, haven't we? Like most kids growing up, I experienced unexplained things that I was too afraid to talk about. As I got older, I kept ignoring those things as they kept getting stronger. Fast forward to 2019, I experienced a life-changing situation that I would never forget. Consulting with some of the most amazing professionals in the field. I have learned how to control and adapt to some of the most amazing experiences in my life. Hi, my name is Tommy. Through the years, I ran into individuals with the same situations, growing up the same exact ways, and experiencing the same exact things. We decided to get together to perform a group where we can explore the unexplained. Please join us on our journey. This is Finding Paranormal. You ready? How's everybody going? We're here. At our last biggest investigation of the year, we are with a huge, a little bit bigger team this time. Um, I want to try to introduce everybody to you. We have Josh. We have Thomas. We have Corey, dead center. Our newest member, Jamie. Hello, everybody. And as of today, we have the lovely Lucy Nestor. And this location is, we are at the Fairfield County Infirmary in Lancaster, Ohio. Um, we have a lot of special guests that's going to be with us tonight. Uh, we have a psychic meeting Reiki master that's going to be walking, doing a walkthrough with me um, and doing a reading as we get through uh, the night. So right now we're going to do a group walkthrough and then we're going to split up and do individual walk groups, teams of twos, things like that. So we're going to go check this place out. Let's go for it. You want me to lead, guys? Yep. Really? Yes, please. All right. Let me get my gibble right. Here we go. I am recording you, Yep. First time I've used this gibble. So we're gonna start from the bottom, guys. Work our way up. Whew, that's 
the scary hallway. That's the scary hallway. That's the hallway that Miss Lucy does not like. <laughs> so far, we are doing an awesome. Lucy don't like being on camera. <laughs> Yeah, morgue. What do you guys think? Should we go in the morgue? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Lead the way, guys. I will right. get y'all. You all right, Corey? Yeah. There's big dots on here, but I think it's just from like a light reflection. That is very, very possible, big man. You all right? All right, we're going into the morgue if you want to join us. The morgue. So, Luce, what do you think? We getting a good vibe in here? Um, the crawler is still in that room. <laughs> yeah, I think I initially agree with that. Um, I'm definitely, I'm definitely getting something here. Josh, what do you think? Man? There's something in here. Have a seat too in the chair. Let's see, walk around for a few moments. Where is that? Thank you, thank you. Shoot Lucy. Jamie. Lucy. Shoot Lucy. Shoot Lucy. I literally can't move, guys. Oh, he's there. I can see him. He's there. Ow, my shoulder just popped. I'm doing this in an awkward position. <laughs> very, very awkward position. First time ever using the the gibble at any of my locations and I'm doing this in an awkward position, <laughs> but I'm getting a good shot. <laughs> I'm gonna go in the cooler. Jamie, do you see me on my phone? This is very awkward, very awkward position. I mainly see Lucy. I see your head yeah. a little bit. Guys, I'm All right, let me um, come from the view. Sorry. You're good. You need to go down a little bit, but I'm trying to. I mean, uh, there we go. Yeah. This is a very, very awkward position, trying to hold a gibble, a cell phone gibble. Do you see Lucy and me now? I don't really see her head. Yeah, 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 now you see her head. What happened? Yeah, it's a very awkward position, so let me <laughs> spin her back the other way. Woo, wrong way. <laughs> Is someone just laughing? 
in there with you? Yeah, he just heard it in here. I'm about fell over. I know, I did when I was. Uh, that was weird. Did you guys ever experience that yet? Yeah. yeah. Like you're about to fall over and there's nothing there in your way to. I was doing. I came out alive. Where that? Where he's at? You probably caught it on yeah. the camera too. Is it thick? It's freaking awesome. It's almost like there's somebody legit behind me. You guys want to just, what do you guys want to do? You want to keep walking? Yeah, yeah. Well, I think we need to keep walking, guys, just to, so we can get through for our scheduled right. um, psychic median walkthrough here in a bit. Yeah. I say we should go across the hall. The... So did you guys actually see somebody behind me when I stopped? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Because it felt like he come up behind me and just grabbed both my arms. And I'm like, so, ah, guys, yeah. I can't move. And there, there was a big shadow behind me. They might have got it, but I probably didn't right away. Corey, you good? You ready? You guys can lead the way where you want to go next. Physi physician room. This is the old doctor's hot, uh, room where they used to treat the patients. Good oil for epilepsy. epilepsy. Whoa. What? Oh, we got a bug in here. Hey, get, get. Shoo. We got a moth. Shoo. Shoo. Your Shoo fly. Just to give you that initial view of what a bug looks like. He's in here every day. But this is where the doctors used to treat the patients when it was an infirmary. So there is a bug, a moth. Where'd he go? It's right by you. <laughs> Language, please. It's a moth. You guys the editing it, is it? Gotta make it easier, Jamie, not harder. <laughs> cool, yo. Keep walking. So the first time using a gibbel, testing it out, see what we can do. We're just walking around, starting from the bottom, working our way up to the top. Hey, Tommy, they're doing a lot of pop-outs tonight. Pop-outs, huh? Yeah. Okay. Popping out and then running and hiding. Mm -hmm. We've experienced that before, though, haven't we? Yep.
that's all I'm saying. Just get me over here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, he was just thinking that way. Yeah. That's very possible, guys. Yeah. That's very, very possible. I think it was that little girl. Was it a little girl? Yeah. We, like get, we get her a lot. She likes to... Um, it's about, about three foot. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's a perfect description of her. She likes to play hide-and-go-seek with people. Our moth is back. Where's it at? Yeah, right beside Lucy. It's coming around. It went in this door frame here. I feel like it's a spirit inside. No. Okay, Thomas? Mm -hmm. You okay? Yeah. All right, so we're going to the funeral parlor. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> so this is where they did a funeral. Already got Thomas sneaking in the backside there. Well, he's not there. Last time we were here. It's kind of freaky how a toy was in the middle of the floor. Yeah, I stepped on it. I'm like, what the heck? I think we're going to avoid the back hall, that one hallway section because of Lucy. We can, it'll be all right. You sure? Yeah, we can. I don't want you freaking out on me, no, man. We're good. All right. True, true, Ryan. <laughs> no, she's not going to someone and say, I just grabbed somebody. Yeah. Like, oh. But you're not walking first. I'm not walking first. Right. No. Oh, wow. I didn't even realize that. Like, that All right there, Josh. Yeah. Just checking her out. Yes, yes, I think that was initial yeah. waiting room area. Yeah. Some really, really old song books. But someone, someone had fun with paint. We have some really, really old newspapers. I'm proud to be a son of Uncle Sam. That was in 2001, and then right above it is 1962. How cool is this? The wall from the original wall. Yeah, this is the original wall. 1828, wow. Does have a different vibe in here. Does have a different feel. Um, this is the section that spooks out Lucy every time she comes in. This is where the old boilers and stuff used used to be. You okay, Luce? Yeah. Good, good. Your women okay, right? Yeah. Jamie, this is your first initial investigation with the team. Our last individual's first initial investigation was that man right there, Mr. Corey. Madison, I think, was the best one for him. His very first. This is the meeting room when they have special guests. They set up chairs and they do their... Christmas dinners, and Christmas stuff. dinners and stuff like that in here. <laughs> so yeah, look, answers and questions, you know, questions and answers. It's where Chris Williams and several others from Ghost Hunters TV show. Um, this room is awesome. Wow, we still got three more floors, guys. <laughs> you guys survive. Yeah, can you survive? Can you make it? What do you think, Luce? We make it? Yep. 
Which way? And he's made it in the hallway. So All right. So I guess we'll go up the back staircasing. Let the men walk last. Jamie, I think the makes walk last. Joseph won't see you. Normally it's been Corey lately, guys. Huh? Coming last. Corey's the man. Corey in the house. He's coming. I don't see that Now we're on the second floor. This is the women's side, or win, men's side of the second floor. Got to make sure we read the signs perfectly clear, Thomas. No smoking. <laughs> I like messing with Thomas. So cool. Yeah, I quit smoking like 10 minutes ago. 10 minutes ago. <laughs> I think that was the last initial cigarette you had was 10 minutes ago. No, I feel better about myself. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is the men's side. Whew, man, I feel the vibe. It's, um, it's like, what do you think? Is it pretty yeah. thick? Yeah. For some reason... It's definitely very, very thick. Um, <laughs> this is the one of the back staircasings. Kind of want to do the walk through for everybody to see. And pizza was good though. Yes, it was. Give us the. Yep, Donatos, man. Adam's gonna be mad at us because we we can afford the expensive pizza. <laughs> All right, I think we can go up one floor now. That hallway there's. Yeah, we've been painting. Took my camera so we can see up the steps. All right, this is the active room hall uh, floor, guys. Oh, wait. Did we miss a section? Yeah, the bump out downstairs. The bump out downstairs, Sarah's room. Oh, my God. I can't breathe. Yeah, I can't breathe either. This, this is the hallway where those who watched Designation Fear, this is where they got the steel door opening. And... Wow, it's thick in this hallway, guys. It is really, really, really thick, guys. This room. Active. This room. Active. This is the women's side. On the third floor, this is where Destination Fear got the steel door at the very end of this hallway. As you see right now, it's open. This whole hallway is thick. Man, this. This is the room. Oh my God, it's thick in here, guys. Everybody's left. Things to communicate with the spirits in here. Photos, cigarettes, money. Boy, it's it is thick in here. Oh my god! You all right, Luce? Look at all that all over the table. Oh, moldy. Chest is not it got it got hardened, right? Like something is initially pushing. <sighs> Jamie, you're killing me. Right? All right, let's move on. 
This is the hallway. I think we're going to spend a lot of time in this hallway, guys. She's in there. Yeah, she's in here in 315. I felt her when I came up. She's definitely... Boy, I'd like to see what Chrissy's got to say. The room Jamie likes. This is the most, one of the most active rooms right here. And, it, you know, we've had incidents all through this whole area. Ooh, what was that? What was that? I just got something that darted across that hallway. Down the hallway there. It's something darted. Ooh, did you see that? Mm -hmm. Look, look. It's affecting my camera. It is. You see how it zooms it? Made it fuzzy, and something darted at the end of that hallway down there, on the other side, on the on the men's side. Ain't that where we got that thermal mm -hmm. spot? Yeah. Should we go down on the bump out, the old section, and check the boys' room out? Yeah. Since we forgot Sarah's room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something darted down this hallway. I seen it initially. Wow. The hallway was lit up, and now look at it. Something darted across there. It just did it again. Hmm. Oh, she sent me the attachment. I gotta stop my recording. Well, what time is that supposed to be? 10 o'clock. Where we at? <laughs> this is the boys' room, right? The little boys' room? 947? Yeah. All right. This is the little boys' room. Beneath us is Sarah's room, which we totally forgot to. To walk through that. And Mike just sent it to me. Um, different way. Nice. Um, it, so this is oh, I am recording. This is Sarah's room. That's not the little boys. No, this is the little boys area. Sarah's is underneath it. Let me just message her. All right, we got one more floor. Wait, you want to go to the men's side real quick and then go up? Or oh, wait, yeah, men's side. We don't, we did get some out of here, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I believe right over here is where we got that thermal. Yeah. It was right here along this wall. Right here. Whew, man, it's thick over here. Thick. Are you uh, picking something up, Luce? Oh yeah, she's, she came out of the, her room. On the other, down the other side? So she's watching us down the hallway. Yeah. And we experienced her quite a bit the other day, didn't we? All right, 
She's cool. She said, got it. So we got a little bit of time, guys. Yep. And then, if you, I mean, honestly, I am you, sweating too. If you want, you can start her walkthrough upstairs, so we're not free walking with you. Well, I want to go back to base before I initially okay. do the walkthrough with her, because I want, I want her to meet everybody. Man, this this yeah. room right here, this hallway, is going to be a very very active hallway, guys. Yeah. For sure. And just think, I haven't even done my energy work yet. Yeah, once we do that, that's really going to boost it. Yeah. Oh, my God. Did you hear that? That's why I smacked you. Oh, my God. Did you guys that hear that? Yeah. What just broke? What just grabbed me? Wait, something was here? Yeah. It wasn't. Something no. grabbed the top of my walk. You, you, didn't, like you didn't click it on the... No, something grabbed the top of my walk. You went like that. Did you guys hear that up steps? Yeah. It was loud. I actually walk up the steps before you guys even say anything. This is on the other side, right? Yeah, this is to the right. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've never been up here so dark in my life. It is dark. I gotta use my flashlight just to get my phone to see something. It's like extremely dark up in this area. Oh my God, it's thick up here guys. Thomas, dude, it's... Alright, I'm going to walk back over this way. Oh my god. I think the most active spot is straight ahead in the chicken coop. But I kind of want to get everything on... I can't breathe, man. It's like really, 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 really thick up here. Dude, dude why are you? I'm, at, I'm in the middle of an investigation. Why are people freaking messing me? Dude, did you see my phone and the way it twitches with with the recording? This is making my phone literally go nuts. Like it adjust, it's, it's adjusting. You know what I mean? Since it's motion. Thick. It's really, really, really thick in here. Standing on my arms, it's. Did you just blow on me? No. It's like a blue on me. Getting any difference? Just one degrees. It feels cold. There's a lot of dust orbs because of we're walking, but. Yeah. Um. Watch your head, guys.
Oh my god, look at Um, look at my phone. Look how dark that is. Yeah, that's dark. Dude, that's Thomas, dark. look at my phone. Did you light on it? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Mine got all the crap all over it. <laughs> Your lens is dirty. Yeah, that would. Why is it so dark in this area? And a whole entire building this is the darkest. Why? What is causing that? Why is this burnt? Why is that burnt? Look. It's not that pattern. Um. Is that? Where did that come from? The ceiling. Ah. It still looks like it's burned. Or it just got wet initially. Yeah. Well, I, my, but I, my question is, why is my phone so dark? The light is on. But yet, this is the only room that is dark in. I think the energy... What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Bro, something back here like growled and then stomped really hard. That was after I grabbed him initially. Hey, cool. You still want to uh, be that? Uh, I do that. Yeah, but not initially, but I do now. All right, yeah. all right, all right. Shh, 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 shh. Is there someone with us? You want to come out and talk to us? I'm hearing footsteps. Yeah. And I heard a whistle. You want to come out and talk to us? Um, something is outside of the chicken coop and it's moving around and I can't get it on camera. Is that what you're seeing? Something crawling, Thomas? Yeah, right here. Something, something crawling. I think it's probably Lucifer. Right by the doorway. This is the doorway. I swear I've seen something in my own eyes walking. Oh my God, this place is freaking. Um. Watch your head, guys. Watch your head. Watch your head, guys. That thing is real low. Watch your head. Yeah, I already it. I swear to God, right here in this door frame, Right here. I feel like whatever it is. It's, something was right here. It was walking and I heard a whistle. Mm -hmm. I swear whatever it is came from up there. Go up there. I don't know, but something tells me it came, whatever it is came from up there. It was in there, it went up stairs or something. Man, it is so thick up here right now. There's someone up here. Do you get anything? Are you getting anything at all, Josh? There's a cold breeze up here. Hey, Josh, you got my folly. Alright. Just be careful because I don't know how sturdy that is up there. How much room you have up there, guys? I don't know how many y'all can fit up there. About four people up here. Yeah. 
Yeah, Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. That was right on my right side. I don't like my back. Like, I don't know. I just... That was over here, like something knocked on this wall. Or by the staircasing. I'd say if I were one person really good up here, we'd go back to the last. Yeah. Yeah, too much grass around here. Holy crap. Yeah. But wait a minute, the glass we heard that was down, the, the, the glass was downstairs, not up here. Yeah, we got a bunch of glass going right here. I just heard something knock on that wall. Yeah, I heard something. It sounded like a chair. Does it look cool up here? Yeah. 38 degrees. 38, yeah. Down here, 80 degrees. Yeah, there's something. What do you think? Should we um? Cool. Window is, uh, yeah. It's after ten o'clock now, so yeah. I need to take a little break before I do the yes. initial walkthrough. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. All right, guys, we're going down the base. All right. so keep recording until we get to base, please. I'm gonna go down these steps to make sure he's all right. Is he alright? I think he's coming down. I just want to give I want to give you guys some room so you can walk down. Try to initially show you. Is it hot up there? Is it? You good, Josh? Yeah, I heard something out there. Yeah, there's, there was someone up there. Okay. All right, we're going to go down to base, and I need to get a break before I get a hold of time with Chrissy. Huh? I think it was more the growl and... Yeah, the growl and the stomp. I think you might, there's another piano. Stop, yes. Okay, so you can walk all the way through like the way you were about to go, correct? You could just walk, yes. if you were to move to your right, you could walk right through. Okay. Yes. Um, I feel like that, can you go back to the piano? Don't, no, don't leave the room, go back. Um. There's a woman in that room with you. Okay. I feel like that piano used to be up against that wall. And there used to be wallpaper on that wall that had like, um, it was lighter white, but it had like some sort of pattern. And as I'm talking, my neck is starting to cramp all in here um the woman is standing against the wall next to that that light switch she's dressed turn of the century her hair is um in the bun that kind of pushes down so her hair looks kind of poofy uh, she's got the long skirt on. She's just kind of standing there. I feel like she probably. All right, we can we can go back and use those apps afterwards that I sent you, the bird app, so you can watch it. Okay, so I'm being told to, to tell you to ask who she is and what she wants or needs you to do. And hopefully, we'll get an answer on those. Can you indicate who you are? What is it you need me to do? Is there something you need us to do?
Who are you? Hmm. Um, maybe I can drop that in there. One, uh, fire. Where? Fire. I'm picking up on fire. Okay. Um, there's a fire somewhere in the building. I see people having to event. Oh, I wonder if that's why I picked up on somebody having to run and get out. Um, it's, because I see people and it's only in one section though. Like it's not a mass exodus. It's more of, um, like a certain section. And I feel like the head or the warden and I, and I'm warden is coming to my mind and I don't know why, but it's like whoever was in charge, you know, or of that section or that. Yes. Write it down. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting the name Matthew as well. Okay. Uh, okay. Do you do you know if there was ever a fire in one section of this building? Yes. Okay. Because I was picking up on during the break when Mike and I were talking, um, I saw a fire, but it was only in like a section of the building. Like it wasn't a mass exodus kind of an idea. It was a section had to evacuate. Um, it was a certain would, would area like that was. Would you like me to take you? Yeah, that'd be great. Do you want me to take that, you to that spot? So you can validate that? Yeah, validate it for me. That'd be great. <clears throat> and this would be the question is, they were coming out of the basement. You're coming out of the second floor, walking up to the third. Okay. This would be the third floor. This is where we just at with the, um, the older lady in that room with the EVP we did. Okay. Um, we're actually going to come around. So we were down there with the EVP session we just did. Okay. Now we're going to go up to the final fourth floor. Okay. 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 Just, you know, Christy's talking about that person. We're trying to run through that door. We're wondering if that was in the same section. Now we, this is where, before I initially logged on where we was getting a lot. I don't like that corner of that staircase. Kind of weird. Now, this is wild because it is completely dark with the light on. Yeah. So I'm going to grab my flashlight. And it help and use it. Was that a now, rec yard? It, what? Is that Was that like a rec yard? <laughs> well. Used use as like a gym or an exercise area? No. Okay. I like so to show this, you something. This is where the fire was up here. Yes, but it's not in this area. <laughs> Are you picking stuff up in this area, Christy? Yeah, I, I didn't like it when you walked in there. It's a very heavy energy. I don't like it. Now I can see why. <laughs> oh, I don't like that either. Oh. Patience. Oh, go over what by that change? door. Go, go by that door. No, no, no. Go to your right to that little... Oh, Quarantine. that was that was not good. People got beat and tossed in there. It was almost like a homemade sludge. Oh, oh my God! Go closer, go closer to that door, please. Is it? Are you able to open it, or is that locked? No, it's, locked. it's a padlock. Okay. The reason I I brought you to this spot is 
See the holes? Wall anchors? Yep. This is the original hooks. They were chained to the wall. There were some severely, severely mentally challenged people up there. I see people sitting in there who can barely function, whose minds, they were just... Do you know if there was an in-house residency or a staff section of the building where they would live inside the building? I don't know. And I just looked that. The breathing thing when we first walked in, that was anxiety and not yep. I, that's like, exactly that's why. That's exactly what I get every time I come up here. Now, oh, my initial goal bringing you up here was to show you the section that was on fire. They call this the chicken coop because the door it has chicken wire. Okay, that's 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 new chicken wire. That's so the door frame is so short you have to duck when you walk through it. Okay. Okay. So you're gonna go back you're gonna go back and watch our Oh my god. It's it's exactly what you just described. Oh my god, it's in my notes, Tommy. We were talking about the notes. I was kind of recapping for people the notes. That wasn't the basement. That's this room. Oh my god. Me guess. So, Part of my language. The fire happened in that corner right there. Is Do they know, do they have a cause for the fire? No, but it took them an hour to put it out. Mm -hmm. People, it, that section had to evacuate. This corner was on fire. So up there, I picked up on more of like a warden style type person. Okay. Does that make sense to you? Yes. Why? There was a warden that ran this area and he actually committed suicide. And it was not in this building he committed suicide. 